Good morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Wednesday. It is early. It's 5.52 in the morning. We're going to make some coffee. I know it's so early, but I need my coffee. Um, I started work at 5.30 today. I'm trying to get off work early today because... Um, what is it? AJ and Vanessa's aunt and uncle, which is Ariel's brother his wife and their two kids they're gonna be coming over today they drove down well they're driving down from the bay area right now and they're going to disneyland i believe they're going to disneyland tomorrow and the next few days not today so that's exciting i haven't seen them uh in a couple of years so i'm excited so yeah i'm trying to get off work early today <laughs> so that's why i started work super early okay so Let's make some coffee. Let's use this mug today. This is from Disneyland when they had their 60th anniversary. It's super cute. There is like a really long message here. It says the most magical time of the year is the holiday season since 1955. The Disneyland Resort has been celebrating the holidays with joy, merriment, and lots of cheer. Each year, the Disneyland Resort creates new and lasting memories for guests of all ages. This artwork was created for the Diamond Celebration, commemorating 60 years of holiday magic at the Disneyland Resort. I don't think I've actually read that. <laughs> or it's been a really long time because I do not remember that at all. But yeah, isn't that super cute? And you guys, I always love the mugs with the D handle. Those are nice. They're like really easy to hold on to. We're gonna go with this one again. Frosted sugar cookie. I'm making scrambled eggs for Callie. Callie, are these your eggies? She loves scrambled eggs, you guys. Look, she's so excited. These are your eggies? Okay, you gotta wait. Here's her eggies, and then we have to blow because it's still too hot. And then she gets so mad, she thinks I'm gonna eat it. It's hot. Okay, here's your eggies. Here you go. Show everybody you love eggies. Look. I think, I'm pretty sure eggs are her favorite food. She acts like she hasn't eaten. I know, whenever I give her eggs, she acts like she hasn't had food in like years, <laughs> days. She's like starving. <laughs> oh my goodness, you love eggies? And I just give her one egg, nothing in it, no, no seasoning or anything, you know, just a plain egg, scrambled egg, and she loves it. She will lick the bowl clean and she scarfs it down. Vanessa wanted scrambled egg, so I made her scrambled egg, but I made it like like an omelet, but there's nothing in it. Not really an omelet, but do you know what I mean? Squares. Squares, yeah. And then I cut them and then here you go. So hold on, guys. All right, let's put it, turn it this way. That way? Yeah. <laughs> I got it so bad. Oh well, and then you can put ketchup. Yeah. Yay! Right. Ta-da! Her breakfast sandwich with just Hawaiian roll and egg. I just got myself a butter bell. Do you guys have a butter bell? Have you heard of it? Um, I actually had never heard of it until I saw it on TikTok. But you basically can keep your butter here. Um, you can keep it out on your counter at room temperature and it doesn't go bad. You actually put a little bit of water in the base. Hold on. So here's the base. You would put a little bit of cold water in here and then the butter goes in this part, the bell. And so when you put the, the butters in here, okay, you pack it in and you are supposed to change the water every like two to three days and they say this can last on your counter for two to three weeks. I don't know if we'll actually go through our butter that quickly. I might only put half a stick of butter in here at first just to see like how fast we go through it. But this does hold one stick of butter. So yeah, that'll be nice because we always want to put like, you know, butter on 
bread, but then it like, the butter's too cold and then it rips through your bread. So I wanted to get this and we'll try it out. We'll see how we, how we like that. The next day. Good morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Thursday. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, Papa Happy Bear. Thanksgiving, Mario. I'm He's cooking. cooking. And then Ness is back there. AJ, he's actually at work. He gets off at two? Three. Three? I thought two. Okay, well three. He gets off at three. Happy Thanksgiving to all you guys, your family, your friends, everybody. Yes. And Papa Bear is making us breakfast. He's making us spam tacos, spam and egg tacos. And I have work today. So, yeah, that's great. Okay, let's make some coffee. I'm gonna use this mug today. Meet me under the mistletoe. Super cute. Okay, which creamer should we use today? I feel like I haven't used peppermint mocha in a while, so let's go with that. Peppermint mocha, sugar-free. Here is the breakfast taco that Papa Bear made for us. So it's just Spam, egg, and green onion. And he puts cheese on his um, tortilla, but I don't want it with cheese. But, you know, you could put cheese if you want cheese. And then I'm going to put some salsa. Okay. Then you put Mrs. Renfro's habanero salsa. The best. The salsa is so good. It's my favorite. Do you guys remember? I don't know if you guys will remember this, but the very first time. Let me put you over here because the lighting. There you go. The very first time I tried the salsa, I didn't even really like it because I said it tasted like Tostitos. <laughs> Do you remember that? It was at the old house when I first tried this salsa and now I love it. That's literally my favorite salsa. Okay. Irresistible, huh? Uh-huh. Mmm. <laughs> We're done. Who? You. Oh, yeah. <laughs> good thank you look at these two they're trying well Vanessa's trying to teach Papa Bear how to make the paper stars what is she eating what is Callie chewing on oh she's trying to teach him <laughs> she's teaching him how to make the paper stars and he can't even get past the the knot <laughs> make it tighter make all the corners touch yeah like okay we'll come back let's see his star at the end to puff it out <laughs> you guys Stop. you guys why is it so crumpled up <laughs> you're just like smushing it <laughs> look at the back <laughs> it's like gum it's like gum papa what the heck is this Winter at least you can kind of tell that it's a star like you could totally see the shape of it <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, let us know when you make like you're yeah. successful at one, okay? I think Papa Bear finally got one. Let's see it, Papa. Oh, she's eating the she's trying to eat the paper. Yeah, hold on. Let's see. It's a lot better. At least it's not flat. See, that's where I'm kind of It's definitely puffed up. Yeah, we're giving him thicker paper. I think the problem is this paper's too thin. So the thicker paper might be easier for him. Callie. Okay, this is Papa Bear's best one, you guys. I, we gave him a thicker paper. This one is kind of like sparkly. And he did really good. Good job, Papa Bear. Yeah, so thicker paper is easier. So I just took the rib roast out of the fridge. I trimmed off some of the fat and then I just seasoned it all around with some salt. We're gonna let this sit here and come to room temperature. And then we're gonna make like a butter herb thing that we rub all over it, but we'll do that later. You got someone new, I know it. Yeah, but I will keep on denying. Yeah, gotta keep my emotions running wild. Need someone to hold my horses. Yeah, 'cause 
I go fast, yeah, I go hard. Wanna find some peace, so I pray to God to find a way to fix it all. just like little smokies with the crescent roll. These are going in the oven. Here are Vanessa's little crescent piggy blankets. Try one. Sure. Hot, really hot. We were gonna do pepperoni and cheese and then you could dip it in marinara, which is also really good. Or you could do like ham and cheese, but we don't have mozzarella and I didn't want to do it with cheddar. So we just made more little smoky ones and they're in the oven right now. We say we were good together I would say we had fun But our trails will never run forever Something else is on your mind Like everything that's good just took this out of the oven so we're gonna let this rest and it's still cooking you know as it sits here and it rests so we're gonna let it do its thing we have baked potatoes these are also done they're very hot but I covered it with foil to keep it hot and then I'm also going to steam some asparagus but I'll do this like last minute because this is really fast For dessert, we have this Marie Calendar. Let me see the box. I can tell you. I can show you. The kids bought this yesterday at Walmart. It's Marie Calendar's chocolate brownie cream pie. All you have to do is put it in the fridge to thaw because it comes frozen. So yeah, you just put that in the fridge to thaw. And then we also have Miss Patty LaBelle's sweet potato pie. So good. We are re-watching the dog show because we didn't get a chance to watch it earlier. 
and we were telling Callie to watch it because maybe she can learn some tricks, but she's too busy playing with her ball. <laughs> Where's your ball? Oh, there it is. Get your ball. Ow. Get the ball, Vanessa. Throw it. Bring it back. <laughs> 